One of the absolutely great features of Talk 3D is you can automatically apply wind effects to objects such as trees, increasing the realism of your games. Tree models made with Forrester Pro are fully compatible with Talk 3D's wind effect system, allowing you to create immersive environments very quickly. And it isn't just palm trees that look better with wind effects. Deciduous trees such as this maple forest, made with the Forrester Light, the free version of Forrester's maple tree, and conifer forests look much more realistic with a subtle application of wind effects in Talk 3D. Wind effects together with LODs are exported automatically by Forrester Pro for Talk 3D. It couldn't be easier to export tree models from Forrester Pro for Talk 3D that have wind effects. This is the birch tree model which comes as part of Forrester. To export it we simply go to the export menu under file in the export menu we can specify we want collision meshes and that this model will be exported for Talk 3D. In the Talk 3D options menu we can specify that we want LODs and whether we want wind effects to be applied to leaf meshes. Different leaf fluttering behaviour can be applied to each leaf mesh type that's specified in the tree. We can choose radial, length and length symmetric dependent fluttering for each one of those leaf mesh types. And once we export this model for Talk 3D, Forrester Pro will calculate the vertex colours that are required by Talk's wind effects. It's really easy to import Forrester Pro tree models directly into the world editor of Talk 3D. We can use the Forest Editor and in the Properties panel select the Meshes tab and Add New Mesh. All we now need to do is select the Collider file that was produced by Forrester Pro and press OK and that model will be imported as a new mesh for the forest editor allowing us to paint trees directly onto the landscape. Because we selected to use LODs and imposters during the export from Forrester Pro when we paint trees further away from the camera the lower resolution model that was automatically created by Forrester Pro will automatically be used by Talk 3D dramatically improving the performance and the number of trees that we can apply to our level. When we paint trees at the largest distance from the camera, Talk 3D will automatically use imposters or billboards for models produced by Forrester Pro, giving us an additional performance boost. Applying wind effects in Talk 3D is very straightforward. We just go to the object editor and then under library levels and environment we'll find the wind emitter which we can just double click to add it to our level. Then we simply need to set up the properties of the tree in the forest editor under meshes in order to apply the wind effects. A tutorial on how to add wind effects to Talk 3D is available from Talk's website and includes the appropriate choices for these properties to make realistic looking trees. Forester can be downloaded from our website and includes a free version, Forrester Lite, that allows you to make models of seven different types for non-commercial projects and, of course, for development. Anyway, we hope you enjoy Forrester Pro.